So you want to learn how to make one of these cuties right here? All right, I first learned about this really adorable wrapping idea um, during a team call that I helped host um, through Posh Crew. Thanks, Shaleen, and Audrey was amazing. Seriously, we have the most amazing women in this in this company, Perfectly Posh. But anyway, so I, I heard about it, but I hadn't seen the pictures. I'm like, what are they talking about? I want to know how to do that. So I am very resourceful, and I love Google. So I Googled and found some really cute ideas on how to do this. And I noticed that all the soaps were kind of small, but us in Poshland, like we love our soaps, you know, to be handled with two hands. I mean, seriously, these are huge, right? So I uh, wanted to share with you how I do it and some little tips for consultants and um, for customers who want to do this themselves because they like things to have a personal little touch. And I love that. So let's get started. I bought everything at Walmart, I believe. Um, I got this washcloth, 47 cents. You can buy them in packs, even cheaper. I think they have white ones. I just wanted brown, okay? Um, you can get like the huge pack of white ones, I think, for almost $4. Maybe I'm wrong on that. I don't know. All I know is you can find some really great bargains. Okay, so you're going to need a washcloth. You're going to need your little pom-poms. 97 cents for this whole pack. 97 cents for your eyeballs. Um, I think it was a buck for this cute little spool of green. You can do any color that you want. You can get as fun and pretty and sparkly as you want with this. This is just what I wanted to do. Okay, warm up your lovely little um, hot glue gun, and I just got some glue on me. That's fun. I, this is a low temperature one because I don't really feel like burning my fingers off today. So anyway, low temperature hot glue gun. And I get everything all set up. Oh, by the way, I mean, if you're going to be buying all these supplies and you're going to be buying your chunks, take advantage of the buy five, get one free because you're going to get six, right? So you're basically going to get one free. These are perfect for like office, you know, employees or teachers. These are so adorable and cute. And you can even include a cute little gift tag with a little personalized note on there. Precious. Love it. Okay. So I set my washcloth down diagonally and I'm going to put my bar down. I like to include a sample and this one is in um, in our boxes so whenever you make a purchase from Perfectly Posh they include a catalog and a free sample and this one is this month and it is my favorite. I love it. Okay this is a glycolic acid fast face mask and it eats away the dead skin in like one to five minutes. It's super awesome. Perfect for these winter months when we start getting those little dry patches and just don't forget to moisturize afterward. Okay, so I like to set that on top. And um, also, if you are a consultant, here's a really cute little tip for you. You know the customer who's ordering these for you and you're doing this as a service to them. You might want to just put their referral link on here, right? because they're going to fall in love. All the people that are giving, giving their gifts to, they're going to fall in love with the Posh products and they're going to get nosy and they're going to go on the website and they're going to do some shopping. And we want to be able to give our customer who originally bought them um, all the credit, get them all the perks, right? So they can get lots of free things because that's how we roll. And then just make sure that your consultant name is on there. That way they know who to select at checkout. Very, very important. Okay, so actually I'm going to set this down first. I think that just makes better sense. Okay. And then I am going to lift up my corners and I'm going to roll away from my body because I'm creating the face, right? All right, so that's this is what it looks like in the back and then this is what it looks like in the front and I kind of roll it forward a little bit. So back, front, okay. Then you're gonna take, these are gonna be your ears, right? And I kind of pull it a little bit because we have these large chunks, right? And then um, if you have cute little rubber bands that you want to use to help with this process, that might be even better. Okay, and you're going to take your ribbon, and I totally should have cut this first, but that's okay. All right, so this is the back, because you can see that's where it's folded, and then that's going to be the front. Okay, so I'm going to wrap my ribbon around it. Again, if you have a rubber band, this, this part would be a lot easier to do. And if you're not really awesome at wrapping or like tying beautiful little bows, 
Um, go ahead and just, I'm just going to let this go. I'm going to cut this. This will make my life a little easier. All right, so I got my ribbon. All right, pull, fold over, pull, fold over. All right, take this, wrap it. Make sure you're wrapping around the back. That way your bow will be in the front. This may take you a couple little tries. Don't worry about it. You'll perfect it, right? Now, this is meant to be cute and fun. You know, these would make really cute little, um, cute little wintry bridesmaid gifts or something cute like that too. All right. So basically what I'm doing is I'm tying a cute little bow in the front. No, I can't really see it, but I'll show it to you when I'm done. Oh, but anyway, like I was going to say, they make pre-made bows on elastic, and don't be shy. Go ahead and use one of those if tying bows isn't your thing. Some people are like, my bows are crooked, but it's okay. I think that if it's crooked, it's okay because it's still hand. It's still something that's handmade. You know, we've got great products, and I like to twist them so they look more like ears. Like this, okay? So we've got our cute little ears. All right, this is going to be the, the, um, the face, right? So I'm going to start forming my antlers, okay? You can do these any way that you want, okay? I'm just going to set this here so you can see while I'm doing it. All right, so I take it right in the middle, and I bend it in half, or as close as half as you can get like that. And then I kind of pinch, find a good little spot and like an inch toward the top and just wrap it around. You can make these any way that you want. You can do cute little hearts, whatever. So now I have it like this and then I bend it again and pinch it and wrap it again. And then I just kind of bend it like that. Like, get as crazy as you want with these. These are really cute. So then it looks like that. Super cute. Very easy. Let's go ahead and I like to shove them in there together. I'll show you why. All right, so again, in the middle, fold down, pinch it, get your finger toward the, the one inch toward the top, bend up, fold over, pinch it, wrap it around again, fold it, pinch it, and there you go. And I just kind of bend them so they look cute like that. You don't have to. That's just what I like to do. And then um, I found that it was easier to take it and twist the bottom part and just twist it like that, twist them together. So then they're like kind of like this. So you can see. And then I folded it again so that it's going to be stiff to put inside here. Okay. So then you just kind of set that in there like that. And then do that, so I'll show you. So you just set it right there. Super cute. Love it. Ooh, they're getting fancy on me here. Okay. <laughs> I still do that. Okay. Um, so this is the antlers. You can certainly bend them any way that you want. And then you want to use just a tiny little bit of the hot glue because you want them to be able to reuse the washcloth and you can easily pull the um, low temperature hot glue off of the washcloth without harming it. So I like to do the little nose first and um, let me get it ready. Oh yeah, just be prepared. I'm going to use the big eyeballs this time from the pack. It's a variety pack so I'm going to use good ones. All right, just a tiny little bit. Okay, just show you. Right there. Pull that stuff off and just press the little nose right on there like that. So cute. All right, and then now we're going to add our cute little eyeballs. Again, don't use a lot of hot glue because you want them to be able to use that washcloth without it being damaged. So there's that one, and then that one. And then there you go. You've got a cute little reindeer right there. Super cute. Um, a great little easy way to decorate packages for your customers or your coworkers or your teacher friends. And um, I hope you really like this because I had a lot of fun doing it and I got some work done while I was helping you. 
that's it. I love my job. All right, so my name is Jen. I am a premier consultant with Perfectly Posh, and you can go ahead and um, search our products at naturallyjenny.com. And if you have any questions, don't be shy. Have a great day.